This is word problems with ratio. I would propose the problem, a boy sold pizza on two days at a ratio of two to three. On the first day, he sold 24 pizzas. How many did he sell on day two? So we're going to use the pegs to place our ratio at the top of the board. We have two red pegs and three green pegs. The red pegs are going to indicate our first day. On the first day, we sold 24 pizzas. So we're going to fill in, staying with our ratio, all the way to 24. For each row in the red column, I have to create a row in the green column so that I can maintain the ratio of two to three. So I know that, I, that the boy sold 24 pizzas on the first day, and now the students can calculate to find out how many pizzas were sold on the second day. So we have 36 pizzas sold on the second day. Now I would have the students, using the pegboard as a reference guide, write down the equation. We know that we started with a ratio of 2 to 3. And we can write our ratio now as a fraction. On the first day, we know that we sold 24 pizzas. So now the students can tell me what we needed to multiply 2 by in order to get 24. We multiplied 2 by 12. What we do to our top number or our antecedent, we have to do to our consequence. So we have 3 times 12, and that equals 36. So on day 1, the boy sold 24 pizzas, and on day 2, he sold 36 pizzas.